from, from what the superintendent said today, the things that I would expect to have been done are being done. And she is, uh, she's pointed out that. I think the messaging, as I said before, is, is what has caused this. If your messaging is, I am giving weight to all three of these hypotheses and not one is favoured in the other because I don't have the evidence to push it into one, then you wouldn't even need to mention vulnerabilities. And I think possibly she's mentioned that in the, under pressure in that conference realise that the family haven't been briefed on that, that she was going to say that, hence why you've then had a second one. Because anything that you say as an SIO in front of uh, the press, whether it's uh, an appeal or um, something of that nature, you run it always past the family first. So there are no surprises... So your to... belief today is that Nicola Bully's family, who have suffered already unbelievable... Well, unbelievably, in the last three weeks... Wouldn't, would have been blindsided by the press it's conference a, it's, this morning. It's one possibility. But that is mishandling the situation, isn't it? it? It's, it's, I think it was a bit of pressure that probably hasn't been seen like that for, for, for an SIO for quite a long time, and, and perhaps that's the reaction.